Welcome back everybody. Today we're going to be taking a look at PetSmart and all of the fun things that you can get to thrill and chill your dog or cat, like these cookies. They do have a number of these throughout the store, so you're going to see a whole lot more. They seem to intermix them with some of their merchandise, but I thought their merchandise this year seemed more abundant than I've seen in past years, and it's certainly, you know, very cute. Um, you know, they kind of mix those costumes there in with their squeaky toys and obviously their cookies and chew things there. Some boo bars. I like that they've got some real Halloween themed goodies for you. Lots of pumpkins. I think one of the reasons that I really like the PetSmart options this year is that it does seem more traditional Halloween. The skeletons, the bats, the pumpkins. So I didn't really get a good... Oh, look, a sloth costume. I absolutely love that. And this sumo wrestler, they have a wide assortment of costumes. Sorry, I didn't really dive into them. You'll just have to trust me. There's a little spider one. I love those with dogs. You know, if you're looking for a costume, they've got a great selection at PetSmart. Again, some more cookies. And more cookies. A flamingo costume. I don't think I've ever seen one of those before. Of course, the line is kind of traditional, though. And a bee. I had my little dog dressed up as a bee, I think, the first year we had her. Getting some more cookies. Those cookies look good enough for us to eat. But I'm sure they taste like dog food. Anyway, play and pretend. Here's some squeaky toys that glow in the dark. Rain and a rat. I guess they call it ghoulish gummies. Cookies, cookies. What are those socks? <laughs> Little dog booties. I love this guy though. He's oversized, I guess. Twelve dollars. That is not a bad price for him, I think. I'm with creepy. And look at this. Can you believe this? Pumpkin spice flavored dog chews. I think those were breath mints. That's crazy. Pumpkin spice has invaded our world far too much. We've got some more toys and bones. If you want to pamper your pet. And I guess it's more trick-or-treat toys. Scarecrow. Eyeball. Again, there's that tall guy we just saw in the corner. I love that little mummy next to him. Oh, look at Dracula here. They've got Snoopy, so a lot of Peanuts licensed merchandise. Well, this old ghost, I assume that tongue's probably supposed to push out a bit more when you squeak it. And lots of variety here. It's that wood stock. This is inside of a pumpkin. I just love that skeleton. <laughs> and that little werewolf there to the right. He is adorable. A little Frankenstein something or other. Raccoon, I don't know. Looks like he's got some orange eyes, so he'll fit in. That skeleton's kind of cute, too. Don't know what this thing is. A bat? I love it, though. Very expressive and cute design. They have some sort of outfits and collars. Look at this collar. Looks like a little bow tie that's dripping blood. That is awesome. Some superhero costumes. Looks like these are from perhaps some bigger dogs up there. And we've got some little houses. You got a little Day of the Dead skeleton type, and then this cute little guy is a spider with a fly. Now you'll have to trust me, on the other side of that fly was some eyes, but my camera didn't quite catch it all. And here in the cat section, lots of cat toys. Certainly that witch theme is appropriate. Especially if you've got a black cat. But they do have a wide selection. Don't really know what to say about the cat toys. I don't have a cat myself. But it looks like they've got a lot of fun stuff they could play with. And again bottom here we have another one of those houses but look at this thing here it is a haunted hideout that looked pretty cool 
Anyway, that'll do it for today. Make sure that you stay tuned for more store walkthroughs if you want to check out the rest of the Halloween merchandise here and in other stores. Thanks for watching, guys. Take care. Happy haunting.